guys, it's Andrea. I'm back with another unboxing for Fig Tree and Company. This is a quilty subscription. When you sign up for this, you commit yourself to the whole year. There's, um, you do still pay quarterly, but you're committed to continue to pay quarterly for the, for the whole term. And um, she opens up the subscriptions for the new year. I can't remember when exactly. It's pretty, I don't know, she announces it. Follow them on YouTube, um, not YouTube, but Instagram, and you'll see when she announces it, because it, I think the spots get filled up pretty quick. This is, this quart, the price varies by quarter, depending on what it, what it is. This quarter's cost me $88.20. That's expensive. Let's see what she's got in her. Let's see what she's about. Little box of figs. That's what this. That's what the subscription is called by Fig Tree and Co. Um, little box of figs, 2021. This is box two. Hello, my fig tree friends. Welcome to your second box for your 2021 subscription. We are so glad you have joined us. This box is fall themed, and therefore, by definition, my favorite. Nothing beats fall in my personal book, and I hope you enjoy the goodies as much as I do. We have a really special notion to share with you this time around. Okay. That's from Joanna and Eric. And then it tells us all about our products. First, first thing I'm pulling up is a pattern. And it's super stinking cute. Acorn Woods. Two charm packs and a few ivory prints is all you need for this. Acorns and leaves. This is really cute. Acorn Woods Pattern Info. Follow the Acorn Woods pattern provided and use fabrics as indicated in the pattern. You can also use the cover image for guidance. We used a mosaic charcoal print for the binding and an orange floral for the backing. Those two fabrics are not in the box, but available on our limited edition finishing kit. This makes a 43 by um, and a half by 51 and a half quilt. Pretty, a throw. It's really cute. I may make this. I mean, usually I prefer to make either a twin or a, a bigger, but I find I need to just start making more throws because they make excellent gifts too. I probably wouldn't part with this one though. This one would be too cute. Next, Acorn Quartet Pillow or Topper, 18 and a half by 18 and a half. Use four orange mini charms for each acorn. Um, I think you would just use the patterns that's in here to make this and they're showing you how to make. Oh, Jesus, you scared me to death, Stella. Like a freaking ghost. Hold on. Okay, sorry about that. She was supposed to be in bed. That's what startled me so much. Um, Anyway, there's directions here for the acorn one and the leaf one for either table topper or to make them into pillows. And right down here, she says, um, like you can make it a table topper or you can make it into a coordinating pillow. Come on over to the blog for more info on pillow directions and our tips for finishing from our pillow along the last couple of weeks. If you choose to finish as a simple pillow with an envelope closure, I recommend two 18 by 11 pieces for the envelope backing. Okay. Cute. Okay. Oh, oh, cute. We have a little cutting mat, two sided. Oh, I love the colors. Vintage strawberry mini cutting mat. By Fig Tree and Co. It says Fig Tree and Co. up there. Green and peach. It's pretty.
pretty weighted, pretty thick. This is nice. Vintage Strawberry Mini Mat. We are so very excited to share this with you guys. It's a perfect little companion to set right next to your machine. For last minute trimming, I always have a little mat right in front of my sh machine. Like for cutting off, you know, snowballs, all that stuff. I use it all the time. Or, or to take with you on a retreat, it is two-sided. The green side being my favorite, of course, but the coral is super sweet as well, and it's the perfect size. There's not prices on this stuff. Okay. That was cute. And then we have the box. The traditional green fig tree and co box. Make sure I'm not missing anything in the peanuts. First up we have a pen from Moda, like literally a pen for like my jacket that says create like a lapel pen. Cute. Gold Create Pen. We could not resist this beautiful pen. Whether you use it on a bag or a jacket or a shirt, I thought this would be a perfect addition to any quilter's ensemble. Don't you agree? It's cute. That's really cute. Different too. We have our stickers we can put on our box if we so choose. Put it anywhere we so choose. I'll put it on my fig tree and co box. There. These are nice stickers too. They're pretty um, thick vinyl. You can tell they're nice quality. Cute. Too many charm packs. All Hallows Eve. One's All Hallows Eve, one's Pumpkins and Blossoms. Ooh, these are so pretty, you guys. Okay, this one is All Hallows Eve. It's kind of. Quickly strum through it. I really like this. <laughs> and this is pumpkins and blossoms. So cute. Um. Okay, these two, these two charm packs here, full-size charm packs, are for our main project, our quilt. And these are the pumpkin blossoms. I'll try, it'll be, you can probably see the fabric better on the bigger square than I showed you on the mini. It's very fig tree and co, you know, you can usually tell their fabric their color schemes. Cute. Two of those for our main quilt. The little project. Little project. For the little project, I channeled our recent pillow along. Oh, okay, these are for the pillows. To make four very scrappy acorn or leaf blocks, set them into a quartet and make a coordinating pillow. Yep. Yeah. So these are for the pillows. I use two mini charms, one from All Hallows Eve and one from Pumpkins and Blossoms for a perfect fabric combo. Included in the box are the little bonus or some inspirational labels based on old church... 
too. Some inspirational labels based on old church hymns by Moda's newest designer, Fancy That Design House. I know these will not necessarily be everyone's cup of tea, but perhaps you have a friend who might enjoy them if you don't. I love these. It's a panel you can cut out the labels. Amazing Grace, how sweet the sound. And this is my story, this is my song. Then we've got Tune My Heart, All to Thee, My Blessed Savior, Strength for Today and Bright Hope for Tomorrow, and Even So, It Is Well with My Soul. I love these, these are so nice. I love the looks of them too, very like vintage. Vintage Strawberry Mini Mat. I showed you that. Oh, Well & Co. Cream. Body Butter. Grapefruit and Bergamot. Ooh, yes. <coughs> A lot of fuzzies in the air from these pre-cuts. I discovered these creams on a romantic little getaway to Charleston with my husband a few years ago. And from that weekend on, I always have one sitting next to my sewing machine. Oh, I, I have to keep lotion by my sewing machine too. My hands get so dry, seems like they're. Um, the cream dries quickly and light and leaves my hands feeling so moisturized. This is one of my favorite scents and I'm very happy to share it with you guys. Ooh. Y'all, this smells fantastic. Oh my gosh, y'all, it smells so good. I can see why it's her favorite. It's right up my alley. Oh my gosh. It makes my mouth salivate right here. It's it smells kind of like a tart candy, like a sour candy. I guess that's the grapefruit. Oh, it smells divine and it feels lovely. I will set this by my sewing machine too. And then the autumn stickers. Starting with this year, we decided to give everyone two stickers and let you decide where to put them. Feel free to add them, one to your box, if you keep the boxes, or add them to a folder, notebook, etc. For this fall sticker, we left the main space blank, so you can use it as a label for anything you like. Nice. Yeah, I'm going to store my project in it. This is for the um, quilt. Tomb Charm Packs, like I showed you, as well as the yardage included in the box. This is for our quilt project. God, that lotion, I can still smell it. it smells so good. Okay, we have, I love this fabric. It's the alphabet and the numbers. Apples and pears, pumpkin pie, Cable knit sweater. Uh, this is cute. Fabric is super soft. This is quite a bit of fabric too. I don't think these are just fat quarters. Seems like more than more than a fat quarter. Did I show you this one? I was so concerned with feeling it and looking at it. I don't know if I showed it to you. I'm loving it. I am loving this. I'm gonna make this, I'm gonna make this quilt.
It's like a cream. And that is everything. We hope you all enjoyed all of these hand-picked goodies as much as I enjoyed picking them out for you each and every quarter. For those interested, a limited amount of finishing kits are available on our shop now. Uh, I, I need to look that up since I am gonna make this. I'll put one of these on the back. Um, the total value of your box is approximately $95.90 plus shipping coming to you for $74.20 plus shipping. Like I said, it was 88 total, so the shipping was like 14 bucks. So we got about $20 off. Okay. Yeah, I need to get the backing, I need the finishing kit for this quilt, the binding and the backing. I love my box. All that yardage, y'all. All these labels, six labels, two mini charm packs, two full-size charm packs, the lotion that smells freaking fantastic. I said this pattern, right? This cutting board, the pen, and the um, pillows, and the stickers. This was a good box. This is my favorite one that we've got so far, which we've only selling our second one. I like this one much more than I like the first one. I don't even remember what the first one was, but I love this one. <laughs> what do you guys think? Give me a thumbs up if you like the video, guys. Subscribe if you like to watch unboxings. I'll see y'all at the next one.